Too good to be true? It's a comment that we get quite often actually from people when they find out about what it is that we do, how we do it, and of course the extraordinary results that we cause people. And it's a question that I've had come through right this moment actually from Ranka, asking about the reality versus expectation and whether what it is we do here at Infinite Wealth is too good to be true. So I thought what we could do is really answer this simply. We'll go and uh, go into the storeroom, grab the file out for our customer handover surveys, pull out the very top one there and just see what our customers have to say. But while we do that guys, let me introduce myself. My name's Tim Guest, Australia's leading financial educator and the managing director of Infinite Wealth. I've trained over 18,000 people how to reach their financial goals, whether it be things like home ownership, travel and lifestyle, all led to retirement. We do it using only what people currently have available to them right now. And we do it with very high customer satisfaction ratings. Here we are in the storeroom. All right, so let's get all the files. Uh, here they are, customer handover survey. Now, if it's your first time tuning in, you're a long time follower, welcome back guys, we love to see you and thanks for all your interaction with our posts, like our likes, loves, angries, comment, questions. Don't forget, uh, if you wanna get your own question answered, uh, send it through on one of our social media platforms and someone will definitely get back to us. Uh, and the last thing we ask is that, uh, you know, that you share your, this video with your friends and family on your social media platforms so they can get the benefit of this valuable information as well. Uh, and of course, we can continue to build our audience. So let's find out, right? So here we go, I'm just gonna open it up. Uh, yeah, cover the customer's surname, right, just for privacy. Uh, but what have we got here? We've got Peter and Martin. Uh, and when did they fill this out? Let's one sec. 2nd of September. So when's that? Oh, that was yesterday. All right, so let's have a look. So we survey them. We ask them a bunch of questions about what their experience was like. I'm just going to go through them one by one. So first question here, what was your experience of the Plan Your Way to Wealth evening workshop? So this is a lot of the time how people find out about us by attending one of our free workshops. So... Uh, the plan was just to go to this free event and listen only and learn more info about investing. We surprised ourselves that we signed up uh, there and then and they've given us a five, very satisfied out of five stars. Then they've also said, what's your experience of the Plan Your Way to Wealth one day intensive workshop? So this is a, our premier program where we train people in everything they need to know about their investment strategies so they can do it all themselves. Now, uh, we had no idea what to expect. It was informative, fun. It was fun, that's great news. And we gained very useful information. Uh, it was a great day. Uh, I enjoyed the active listening role play. So that's an exercise that we do. And we got a four out of five stars for that one. So that's great. What else? How did you find the service provided by your client manager? So client manager is the person, the liaison that you work with between all of the licensed and qualified specialists that we have. So people like real estate agents, finance brokers, financial planners. Um, what they've said here is we could not fault Corey on anything throughout this experience. He was very upfront with everything and tolerated our, all our silly questions and those gave us a five out of five stars for that one as well. Uh, now also, uh, how did the, you find the service provided by Infinite Finance? Uh, and my finance manager is Erin Scully. Erin uh, made everything clear to understand and the finance, uh, uh, sorry, I might be, I'm struggling to read this a bit. Erin uh, made everything clear to understand the finance side of this experience, on the finance side of this experience and gave a five out of five stars for that as well. Uh, looks like uh, with Peter and, was it Mark? Yeah, Martin, sorry, they uh, they must have done a strategy that involved them building a home because it's also asked about their infinite wealth part partner builder. Uh, and their builder was Ingenious Homes. We could not fault the service Ingenious Home provider. And that was a five out of five stars as well. Uh, and then uh, we also ask them if there's anything you'd like to see changed or suggestions that you've had for us. We always love to get our feedback from our clients. Uh, not that we can think of. Uh, I did like that Corey and Erin shared their personal investment history with us. We were very skeptical people. Now we are happy investment property homeowners. Oh, that's great. Uh, and then what has now been made possible for you that was not before you met us? And that was a financial plan for their future. So keep in mind, guys, 78% of Australians have no financial plan. So they now fit into this uh, very small percentage of people that actually have a plan for their future. Um, uh, uh, yeah, were you satisfied with the infinite process? Would you recommend us to your friend, friends and family? Yes, we were satisfied, and yes, we'd recommend, and we got a four out of five stars for that one as well. And this is the interesting one here. So not only, because we also do a review of their uh, their purchase as well to see how it goes. So um, great news is that the property's already gone up in value since they bought it, which is great. But the thing that I love mostly out of this one is that when we were doing the strategy for these clients, we sat down with them uh, and put, put together what we refer to as their proposed net cost per week. So how much with all the expenses, all the tax deductions, all the income, exactly what was it gonna cost them per week to have this investment property? We, we proposed and projected that it would be about $57 a week to have this investment property. So this is great, probably a $450,000 investment property proposed to cost them 57 bucks a week. 
but now that we've actually refined it because their property is built, they're tenanted, their actual cost per week, well, there is no cost per week, this investment property puts $3.72 per week in to their pockets. So not only have they got an investment asset, but this investment asset is putting money in their pockets. It's positively geared. So fantastic result. Uh, and as you can see, I mean, these are, you know, we, we survey our clients typically across 11 points of contact across a 12 month period of time. And, uh, and more than 90% of our clients are very satisfied with our service across those 11 points. So that's an incredible result, something that we're very, very proud on, something that we work very hard to do is constantly improve our processes. So Ranka, I hope that asks you, answer your question about whether this is too good to be true, you know, what the, the reality is versus the expectation. I mean, certainly in, in Peter and Martin's case, they're very, very satisfied and the reality was actually far better than what they expected. So I hope that helps you out and answers your questions. Now, a couple of things before we go, guys. Uh, once again, don't forget to interact with posts. We'd love to see your comments, questions, uh, like, love, angries. Uh, if you've got a question uh, that you want me to answer as well, uh, you can um, tag us through any of our social media platforms. So at Infinite Wealth AU or at Tim Guest AU and that'll get in contact with us. And of course, please share these videos with your friends and family so they can get the benefit of this valuable information as well, guys. But that's it for me. I'll be coming at you later on this week with the week in real estate where you can get all the top stories happening from the week in finance, real estate and investment. But bye for me and I'll speak to you soon. See you guys.